the setup is thermos flasks, okay? So these, these can keep water uh, hot for up to 12 hours. Paper cups, um, coffee that I get from the warehouse. Just got your milk, a uh, little thing to, to mix with and got some cookies there as well for the coffee cookie combos. Uh, my real name is John Lowe, but uh, everyone calls me Patchy. Last June, I became homeless here in the Auckland CBD after my vehicle got stolen and I was actually living in it at the time in the Green Lane car park. I was sleeping in it at night and I was doing Uber Eats in the car during the day. I was in a very, very dark place psychologically and I really started to just sort of get to know the homeless community here in Auckland Central. Uh, started to go to like the free meals that the city mission puts on. Um, learned the, 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 the fine art of, of begging basically, or uh, it's called busking. I was carrying around my big homeless backpack and um, it's actually, you can see it, it's that silver and black one at the back of the store there. It had like my sleeping bag and all my gear in it. I had nowhere to store it during the day. Um, and it was a burden for me. And I, I saw a supermarket trolley down the bottom of Queen Street and I thought, well, for goodness sake, why don't I just put this big heavy backpack into the trolley? I noticed in the front of the trolley, there was the space at the front. I was like, what could I start selling out of that? I know, coffee. I would um, boil the kettle um, in, this, in the car park. The guy, there was like a tap there and also something I could plug into. It wasn't long before members of the public started lining up, also wanting to purchase these $1.50 coffees off me. These three girls, Lena, Caitlin, and Ella, who made a TikTok video, they also had the very clever, thoughtful idea of setting up a give a little page to basically get me off the street and make it realistic so I could create the startup company, Patchy's Coffee. And it wasn't long before it got up to 10K and I was able to uh, apply for the lease on this place here at 25A Rutland. So now that I've got a dedicated retail premises, the, uh, we're, I'm going straight for the food license and then for the first mobile trading license for that first um, coffee trolley. Yeah. To those girls, I would just say thank you so much. It's because of you that, that this is really, really becoming a reality. Yeah, because everything costs money and you, you've provided the avenue for the capital to come in to get this startup going. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel to stay up to date with all the latest news from the New Zealand Herald. Click the subscribe button below or check out one of the videos here and head over to nzherald.co.nz for more details on these stories and more.